give it a few, let people start joining in. I know most of you guys haven't seen me go live in a few, so it might take a little bit. We shall see. So right now, I'm heading to um, the Hardy Davidson place. That's where everybody's gonna be meeting at. I just wanna get on here and check in with you guys and let you guys know that I'm okay, everything's going, everything's fine. Uh, there's a few of us that are coming out here already, a few, few, guy, a few guys in trucks that are coming out here, so. How are you guys doing? Thank you guys for joining guys can when you come in please hit that thumbs up let everybody know that we are alive if you guys could do me that favor I would highly appreciate it so yeah guys that's where what's going on what's up what's up everybody thank you guys for joining in here I appreciate you guys um if, can you guys hear me pretty good you guys hit the thumbs up if you can or press one I mean press one if you can hear me pretty good I don't want to be talking if you guys can't hear me that good hello from the UK hello hello thank you thank you guys for joining I appreciate you guys doing that um, so today we're gonna be uh, doing a run we're gonna be doing a prayer run we're gonna go from Lancaster to California City and then when I'm out there I'm gonna pass out the food that uh, I have in the rear of the truck to the homeless excuse me but uh yeah we're gonna go out there we're gonna say a prayer for the boys and I mean it's been a long time guys it's been it's been a while and it's it's crazy it's crazy how long it's been there's some things that I'm not gonna put out here online, guys. And um, it's not because I don't wanna keep you guys in the loop, because I truly do. I wanna keep every one of you guys in the loop, but I just, I can't. Man, we have some crazies out here running around, starting crap, making false reports at the Sheriff's Department, just doing some really insane and really vulgar crap with some crazy allegations, like crazy shit. I don't know, but I do know that I can't, I'm not gonna put, the stuff that we're finding, I'm not putting it out anymore. And the reason why is because of that. Witnesses are afraid to even come forward now. People who seen the boys or had information they're afraid to even put anything out because people are calling their jobs and freaking saying just doing some way out stuff, you know what I mean? And uh, they think it's okay to do stuff like that when it's not. I don't know what's making these people tick to do that, but I just, I don't know. I don't know, guys. But it's not because I don't want to tell you guys what's going on. Like I said earlier, I truly want to keep you guys in the loop. I just can't. Uh, the boys are depending on us. And if we put something out there that can jeopardize the boys because somebody decided to, you know, act like they're super detective, running around telling lies, that could really jeopardize the boys big time because there are people watching the videos lurking trying to see if they can find something to talk about find something to post about be over dramatic and that's all it is to it so um i am sorry guys i mean when i put out that community post i wasn't meaning that i wasn't going to post any videos i just cannot post any leads and um, it's crazy, man. Anybody could come out. Anyone could come out and help us search. But when you come out here and you're starting unnecessary drama for no freaking reason at all, lying and everything else, that is insane. 
so it went it literally went from being a youtube thing and you know just that's cool man people want to go on youtube and try to sum up people up whatever but when you start going to law enforcement and when you start trying to take it to another level and lie and twist things up and make yourself seem like you're just this big old giant superhero then that is a thumbs down so uh i don't have time for that drama guys i don't have time for that crap and none of the people that that is out here searching have time for that drama and that's all it is it's over dramatic bullshit i'm sorry to say it like that but that's what it is so um yeah we're out here in lancaster we're almost to the harley davidson shop if anybody's out here in lancaster palmdale and you want to meet up and you want to you know go out there follow us out you guys are more than welcome to i guess we're going to be taking off like around one so we're going to be out here for a minute guys let me see if i can read through your comments real quick yeah i got my I got Sasha with me, so Sasha. Say hi. Give me Sasha. Stay right there. Stay right there. There is Sasha. So she's with me today. She's been kind of, you know, cooped up and I wanted to bring her with me, you know. So she's gonna be out here with me. I've been having her since she was that big. She was a little puppy when I got her. And she's uh pretty much like a like a best friend, you know what I mean? So, uh, yeah, that's what we're going to do today. And I truly appreciate everybody that's coming out to show love and support. It's, it's very important, guys. I mean, time is crucial. And I, I don't have the time to stop and deal with a little kid who has ego problems. I'm not going to stop and deal with somebody who has problems with their ego. And they want me to, you know, hug them and just love on a grown man that, and that ain't gonna happen i'm not doing that somebody who's who's claiming to be a grown man so that ain't gonna happen guys so we're gonna continue like we have been doing with the search um a few of us did go out there towards san jose and then uh i i know i ended up coming back so i don't believe that the boys are out there i could be wrong i do believe the witness that came forward because her story matches and it doesn't you know i know a lot of people say oh no she doesn't make no sense but there are actually court documents from san jose showing that they were out there so um as far as this drama goes with mike the next door neighbor hey that is crazy we, none of us would have, have never had a security video if it wasn't for mike guys if it wasn't for him opening up his front doors to let us come inside and and video record we wouldn't even have that the fbi would only have it and uh whatever other law enforcement agencies that have the original the original versions and copies of that of what happened out there in california city so um I don't know, man. It's just way too many conspiracy theories for me. Hey, thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you guys who are in here. Thank you guys who are super chatting. Truly appreciate you guys doing that, taking the time out of your life to come in here and, you know, watch and, uh, watch and see everything that's going on and tuning in. So, I mean, it means a lot, guys. So, here we are here at the Harley Davidson shop now. I'm just pulling in. So uh, it might be a few before other people start getting here, but other people will be showing up. Oh, wait, you know what? I think there is a handful of people here already. Yep, there they are. To the right side, we got Matt. I see Matt out there for maybe news crew. What's up, brother? Let me, um, yeah, it's just too much stuff, guys. I mean, I never knew people would act this way towards children it's like oh my god man and i truly regret i truly regret 100 freaking billions guys let me tell you something guys that way you guys don't hear it from nobody else and you hear it directly from me this is kind of i guess you could say my fault and i'm gonna tell you guys why because i truly believe that that guy that we're talking about i truly believe that he changed his way of thinking I truly believe this guy actually wanted to help 
and I needed help flying the drones. So I'm just, for we could cover more ground. So I guess you could say it's my fault. And I asked him if he, well, I didn't ask. I t he told me that he could freaking help and everything else. And that, you know, he's changed and he's a different person. And he ain't thinking the way he used to. But clearly, you guys can see different lesson learned. Lesson learned, guys. And so I want to say I'm sorry to all of you guys. All of you guys for even thinking that this guy could change, you know. I guess one day he could. I mean, but now... It's just way too much stuff, way too much damage, guys. It's 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 insane, guys. I have never in my life had anyone disrespect the way this son of a, you know what, has. It's all about them now. They've made it a them thing. It has nothing to do with the boys. And it's, I'm not the only person who's pissed off, guys. So there's a lot of people that are extremely pissed. And um, I'm sorry, guys. I am sorry, man. You know, that I even thought that this person could, you know, bring something to the table. And But it's apparent that he can't. It's, it's freaking way out. But um, what's up, brother? I'm just live. I'm talking to everybody right now. I'm jump out. But yeah, we're over here, guys. And if you guys can forgive me for that, man, I, I would truly appreciate it. Um, it's already stressful as it is. Going everywhere. Looking for the boys, guys. It's very stressful. Wanting to find them. Kicking, kicking, I'm kicking, I mean, I know how I am, guys, I'm, I mean, I'm kicking myself in the butt, because I feel like I could be doing more, I need to stay out longer, I need to search more, you know, so, that's just me, you know, that's just how I am, I guess you could say, like, I'm, I'm, I'm my worst critic, you get what I'm saying, so, it, it bothers me to know that we haven't found the boys man it, it bothers me I'm sure it bothers all of you guys too I mean there's a lot of you guys who are emotionally invested with finding the boys and um, I just truly feel like I could be doing more and unfortunately guys we are dealing with some very evil very evil stuff you know, so <clears throat> I'm sure you guys see it already. So I don't know. I just want to come live, talk to you guys and, you know, let you guys know that that I'm good. <sighs> just let you guys know that, you know, we're still searching, guys. We're still looking no matter what is being thrown our way. We are still looking. As a matter of fact, I think we're gonna start contacting the US Marshals and I'm not playing. So if something doesn't happen here soon, we need to start contacting the US Marshals and try to get the Marshals involved because we need help. We need help finding the boys. And I get it that there's other agencies that are involved, but I. I'm really thinking that it's time to go a little higher up. So hopefully we get some type of news here soon. And I can give you guys some type of update real soon. What's going on? You go get some hey, ask me if you can grab me something to drink. Here. Hold on. Hold on, guys. Hey, can you grab me a Sprite? Yeah. Hold on, guys. Sasha, relax. What you doing, Sasha? Hold on, guys. I'm going to read through your comments right now.
I guess I'll take this. I, I was gonna grab a Sprite, but uh, he had a Mountain Dew already, so I'm gonna go ahead and just drink down this Mountain Dew. This is uh, a good friend of mine right here, guys. Hold on. Here, come here, Jess. This is a good friend of mine right here. This is Jesse. Right here, he's with uh, uh, Trucks with Attitude. He's gonna start, you know, helping out and, you know, come out and, you know, he wants to get involved as well with her, helping the kids and searching as well, so. You know, there, there's going to be a lot of people that shows up out here, guys. So, you know, appreciate you coming out here, bro. But, um, yeah, I've been knowing him for a very long time, guys. Is this somebody for us or what? Somebody said, hi, Jesse. I'm Jesse. <laughs> But uh, yeah, let me read through your comments, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and jump off. And then I gotta get my, you know, I gotta get her out and walk her around the parking lot. See if she has to go potty or anything like that. So um, let me go ahead and read through your comments real quick. Godspeed as well, Miss Barbara, I appreciate you. Uh, did they test stick adoption dad has? Uh, I don't, I don't know. I don't know, guys. Let me see. Yeah, I know. She been drinking water all damn day. She wants to get out and chill. Usually, I know if she starts getting thirsty because her tongue will be <laughs> out of her mouth. She's good. She's cool. Daybed's case. Ignore the haters. Yeah, I understand, Miss Tina. We were trying to until they took it to another level. A whole nother level. Okay, let's see. So the prayer gathering, we're, we're all expecting to be out there by one o'clock in California City on Aspen. So probably some, somewhere around, I don't know, probably like 1.30, almost close to two. But uh, I'll go live once I get out there, guys. You guys, uh, keep, keep us searchers in your prayers, man. You know, I, I know you guys are doing that already. I appreciate you guys doing that. And I do thank you guys for, you know, all being here and just, you know, helping with whatever you guys can possibly help with. Uh, I'm going to be actually getting my banners today. Ro is going to be bringing my banners down. They're already paid for. So. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do. So if any of you guys want a banner, you guys hit me up. Let me know. And uh, we will get that to you. It doesn't really matter where you are. I mean, we could just ship it out, mail it out, stuff like that. So I think there's a few, somebody here. What's up? Documentary for who? What's going on with the boys, too? Who are you working for? Oh, no, it's just for my YouTube channel, basically. What's your name of your YouTube channel? Uh, it's just John Waters. Uh, actually, there's really nothing on there. Oh, yeah. oh really? Yeah, it's just like I just make some short films. Um, awesome. You from out here or? No, I'm from um, uh, the LA area. So oh, awesome. Yeah. I'm Steve, man. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah. yeah nice to meet you, man. Sorry about that left hand thing. No so worries. No worries. Right. Yeah. Um, uh, yeah, so I guess somebody is out here. They want to work on a documentary. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Um, yeah, I feel like get a lot out of people real fast. Right Yeah, so I just have like a DSLR camera on a tripod. Oh, awesome. Um, and it's just like this car is really cool. And uh, just looking to like get some different shots and everything. We, I mean, we're live right now, man, if you want to. Okay. Yeah, say, no. Hello. Say, yeah, yeah. Yep, so. Yeah, that's that's cool, bro. Okay, cool. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. See why anybody's free to do whatever they want, bro. Yeah, no. Um, if you guys have any like issues or anything, just like let me know. Like I'm not, I don't oh, want to be invasive yeah. or anything like that. No, of course. Yeah. If you have any questions, man? Just hit us up. Yeah. No. Thank you. Thank yeah, you so you're much. Welcome. Thank you. Yeah. Hmm. So I, I wonder if that's the same folks that was out there where when Matt was out there in uh, Cal City the other day. Matt. 
Hold on, guys. Hold on real quick. Now I don't I have my phone the wrong direction. I want to flip it around, but let's see what it let's see will it work. Whoop. Bam, it worked. <laughs> Hold on. Hey. Is that is that the same guy that was doing that working out there the other day in, in uh Cal City shooting that whatever they're doing out there? Documentary, whatever. He just walked up saying that he's doing a documentary behind me. No. That? Yeah, no. he says he has like a YouTube channel or something like that. Who is he? I'll ask. Uh, yeah, just talk. Yeah, yeah, yeah fill him up. I just talked to him a little bit. Yeah, but he said that he doesn't have anybody on the YouTube channel yet, so I don't know. I don't know. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, right here. Yeah. Yeah, that one with the mask on. All right, guys. So we're just trying to figure something out, find something out right now. Um. There's uh, Matt though. Matt's in the background, right there. Hold on, let me clean my lens, guys. I mean, it's a good thing if, if more people want to cover this story. It's a uh, it's a good thing because it will spread the word out even further. You get what I'm saying? It's just I mean, this this whole search has given a lot of people trust issues. Can you guys hear that? You guys hear what I said right now? Can you guys hear me? I forgot how you guys see the Bluetooth. Are you guys able to hear what I said right now? Hey, I'm dead serious. Like this whole search has given, I know me, I have trust issues. I don't trust nobody no more. Like who? who's this? Who's this new guy? Who's this new person showing up now? And it wasn't like that in, in the beginning, guys. It started changing with certain people started doing certain bull crap on purpose so um yep that's that's where we are at now so i do truly appreciate you guys matt's over there talking to him right now so i guess matt's gonna try to fill him out a little bit but yeah, guys, anybody can show up. Anybody can come. If anybody wants to help out and you want to film, whatever, just spread the word. Let the boy, let them know. Let everybody know that we are looking for the boys and the boys are still out there missing. So, uh, yeah, guys, I love you guys, man. I appreciate you guys. Thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you guys for remembering me as well, because I'm sitting here thinking like, oh, man, you know, they're going to be upset with me because I haven't posted nothing and stuff like that and not and i'm sorry guys i am i never meant to um make it seem like i wasn't gonna post anything at all i just can't put leads up anymore guys i can't so uh yeah i will see you guys again in a little bit we will go live when we get to california city and um yep tomorrow i'll be posting a video for sure or late tonight but we will go live again. I appreciate you guys, man. Thank you guys for all your love and support. And for just, you know, being here. You guys, um, keep up the good work. Keep sharing the videos. Put it out there as much as you can. Until we find out what happened to the boys. Sasha, come here. here let me, there she is. Hey, Sasha. <laughs> are, you, are you paying attention or what? <laughs> All right, guys. Much love and appreciation, man. I will see you guys here shortly. If you watch me, I'm signing out, guys. See you in about an hour and a half or so, maybe less. We'll see. All right, guys. Catch you in a little bit.